All right, what's up, guys? It is me, Matt, with Conservative Trades, and I am bringing you into my world to show you my day trading station. This is it. This is where all the magic happens right here. So um, you see, we've got um, four monitors here, four beautiful monitors, one of them being a vertical monitor. And just I'll, I'll just get right to it. I'll get right to it. So this, for, this monitor here on the left is the YouTube channel. This is where I keep the chat up and uh, run the live stream. And of course, on uh, this vertical monitor right here, you've got OBS Studio right there at the bottom. That's kind of running. That's where I stream from or whatever. And above that, we've got FinViz. FinViz. So I got FinViz up. That's kind of where I go for the news and to look at the different tickers and the um, the different uh, you know stats of each ticker and so anyway um, I, I, I used to have Benzinga Pro a Benzinga Pro subscription and that's kind of where that would sit um, and then over here actually where YouTube is is where my trade ideas subscription would sit but I no longer have a trade ideas subscription or a Benzinga Pro subscription that's actually kind of part of my whole little conservative trading niche, learning how to use and access some of the best free resources online um, that, that can pretty much provide a lot of the same stuff that you're paying thousands of dollars to get. So I ended up canceling those subscriptions and I've, I've done pretty darn well, pretty darn well without them. But definitely not hating on you know, I mean, if you're if you're using those subscriptions, um, I don't want to rabbit trail here during the trade 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 station setup video, but um, I, I I think they definitely are useful resources um, for a lot of people out there. So not knocking them at, at all, but just not not a part of what I'm doing here. But as you can see, we've got uh, two uh, beautiful screens that we use to focus on stocks, and this is this is light speed. And this is the main screen. This is the screen that you can see on, on the live stream and on all the recap videos. So you guys are probably already familiar with that one. And I've got, you know, my keyboard right there and my mouse right there. Nice little um, Bluetooth wireless mouse, probably the best one in the world. Um, and then, of course, this is where I, I speak through the, this uh, little podcast and microphone here. Um, the Fifine K669B is a cheap little, I mean, it is basically, basically under $30. You can get this microphone and um, had thousands of really good reviews on Amazon. And, and it's been good. It's been a good little mic. It's been a good little mic. It's a USB mic. You just plug it in and, um, and, and, and get to going on it. So anyway, but um, so you can see here, you know, we've got uh, my main computer. And then up here we've got the widescreen. Okay, and this is where I keep the financial sector, XLF, the tech sector, QQQs, and then we got the spy over here. And I basically have on the bottom is the daily charts of each of those, um, and then the the five minute chart. I keep a five minute chart of each of them up there. And I've got levels marked out. And um, so anyway, you know part of my conservative trading strategy you know I used to I used to have different stocks up on all these screens I mean I'd be trying to trade and I'd have you know four different level twos and I, I would be trying to trade all these different stocks at once and again another part of the conservative trading strategy um, is where I kind of backed off of that and I said you know what I'm gonna keep one stock open at a time down here I'm gonna have the five minute chart the 15 minute chart um, so I can slow down the time frame and then the daily chart. And on the five minute chart, I'll often go between the one, two and the five. And then on the 15 minute chart, I'll go oftentimes, I'll even check the 30 minute in the, in the hourly chart um, as well down there. So it's kind of like the longer time frame charts here and the shorter time frame charts here. And then of course the daily chart. Um, and then, uh, you know, of course I've got the order book and anyway, so, um, so yeah, this is my setup. This is my setup. Hope you like it. And um, and this is my this is actually my new computer. You can see down here. I got all kinds of wires down there. All kinds of wires. I mean, it's a it's a web of wires. And you and you can see that it's a it's a stand up trading station. So oops, I uh, so I stand up. I stand up and work and trade. And um, this is also my workstation here. So I 
I also, a lot of you guys already know, I, I have another job where I work remotely here from home for a web development company based out of Raleigh, North Carolina. And so um, I do a lot of my other work for them here as well. But I do have a stool. I do have a stool. I, I kind of put it outside of the room just to keep the look clean here. Just, um, But I do have a stool that I can sit on if I get tired, if the legs get tired or whatever. Um, but here, here is the new computer I've been telling you guys about. Just had this computer built, custom built. I'll give you a little glimpse into the internal workings of it. Um, it's a pretty cool little computer. It's got It's got a lot of great stuff packed in there and it's been running really smoothly I've really been enjoying it let's see if I can get a little bit more light let's see get a little bit more light to show you a little better down in there and uh, yeah so I mean there's really not too much to look at computers are pretty simple these days um, but I, I thoroughly thoroughly enjoy it um, and it's been doing really well so far and so um, I've got some other little pieces over here. I'll give you. I'll give you some. We'll get a little personal now. We'll kind of get uh, get away from the trading, and I'll I'll just give you a little uh, look in, into some of my personal life. So this stuff right here. This is a, a sound card. I actually um, have a little recording booth attached to this room here. Um, it's actually right through that door right there. And um, but I uh, for for almost 15 years, not quite 15 years, but almost I. I ran a, uh, a small recording studio in, a, in an audio engineering lab out of my home. And so I you know, would run the mic from the booth into here, this vocal effects processor, and I'd run that into there and then obviously operate you know, computer programs for recording. I, I used Cubase for those of you who are familiar with it, Cubase and WaveLab, and that's where I did a lot of my audio editing and whatnot. And so, um, and oh, you know what? I'll show you. Now, here, here's the thing. I'll, I'll say this. I'll say this. You know, part of uh, part of the part of my gimmick. I, I really like people not seeing my face. So, but I do have a picture here in my office that I'm going to show you. It's of me, my wife, and our son. It was it was taken about six weeks after he was born. He's about he just turned a year old now. So this was taken. This picture was taken almost a year ago. Um, but I feel like I can show you this one because it's more of a profile shot. Like you really don't see my face. You just kind of see the side of it. <laughs> but this is, I'm going to show you right now. Up, up here on this stand here um, with, my, with my little mini Asteroids arcade thing. This is my wife and uh, my son and I. And uh, again, six weeks after he was born. So... There, that gives you a little, that gives you a little side, it gives you, it gives you a little hint, it gives you a little hint, you know, um, but anyway, and, and as a matter of fact, all you see is all of our profiles, you see my wife's profile, my profile, my son's profile, so I, I'll give you that much, I'll give you that much, all right, I'll give you that much, um, and then here, here's something else, so th this is kind of the office setup here, I've got my printer there, I've got this cool little sofa couch whatever thingy and um, um, got this cool padding um, soundproof padding over there and um, cool little couch here with this little uh, you can see this pillow this little audio engineering pillow looks like a mixing board um, and then I've got this old TV this old tube TV but this kind of this kind of lets you into the other part of my life here but you got to have the old school video games and that's what I got here. I got a, an old school Super Nintendo, an original uh, NES Nintendo, the 8-bit Nintendo. Let's see, what do we got up here? Ah, yes, Contra. Contra. And what were we playing last? Look at that. Mike Tyson's Punch-Out, baby. That's right. Got a lot of games in here. Just loads and loads and loads and loads of games in here. There's probably, I don't know, 100 games in there. And then we've got the same for Super Nintendo. Not quite as many games, but I've got, got a lot of games in here. And um, I've got a whole other case uh, that's not in here at the moment. But um, anyway, so yeah, this is it, guys. And um, hope you enjoyed this video. And hope this, this gave you a nice little taste of um, where where I'm trading from and what my setup looks like and um, 
yeah, this is it. This is it. So let me know in the comments what you guys think. Let me know if this is inspiring to you. Let me know if you like the setup and what you like most about the setup. And um, if you're new to the channel, consider subscribing. And uh, as I always say, consider joining us in the live stream. We stream live right here on the channel, Monday through Friday, beginning around 9 a.m. We'd love for you to come join us. And to all my regulars out there, um, I'll see you guys in the chat.